everybody. So this first tutorial we're gonna give you on the Medit app is gonna show you just a brief introduction to the app. We're gonna be doing a series of these uh, on Medit and the different various apps that you have inside, scanning, making the most of the apps, how you use them, um, indications, what they do, um, little tips and tricks that you can use. And basically this first one is just to get you grounded, uh, get you going. So I'm gonna show you a few basic things and this will hopefully help you whether you've bought your scanner through being an IDDA Scan Club member, um, through scanclub.co.uk, or whether you just bought your Medit somewhere and, and you don't really know what you're doing with it, you haven't got great support, you know, that's what the DDA is for. So hopefully these will help you with that, um, give you a little bit of education and, and just go take you from the basics to all the way up and uh, see what's possible with the Medit app. Um, so let's get started. First things first, when you get going with your um, scanner that you've been delivered, whether it be an i500, i700, first thing you wanna do is we're gonna go to meditlink.com. You'll register there, you'll log this in, and once you've registered and logged this in, You'll see on the bottom left here, we have this little blue icon. Yes, there will be a little USB in your scanner box that will have MedLink on, but I would recommend going on the internet and downloading it anyway. Why? Because you're gonna get the latest software and there are some really important updates that happen every now and again, whether your scanner might have been, you know, a few weeks or a couple of months in between getting to you from the factory, there will most likely be some updates there. So get on and get the, the latest version um, as the first thing. You can do it even in advance of, of having your scanner. So where do we go next? Once that's installed, you'll get an app that looks like this on your desktop, this little blue icon here with three dots, meta link, which will pop up and you'll have to type your login info there. Click remember me if you wanna be um, be the only person that logs in. If you don't want to be the only one that uh, logs in, if you want other users to have their own Medit link, it's free. So get different associates or whatever. Um, like this is our demo account. So let's bring this up um, and show you one which we've uh, just been making to do tutorials. And I'm gonna click remember me. But like I said, if you've got associates, you don't have to. So first things first, let's have a look. So I've logged in here, let's maximize this. And I'm gonna just give you a brief overview of what you see and all of these different settings. So first things first, we or when we log in, we see the case box. And this case box is gonna list all of your patients that you've made, that you've scanned.